Academy. Uh, Billy certainly had a lot more time on the ball tonight, as you maybe ex expected. Uh, was that the most useful pre-season friendly for us so far, do you think? I think it was in a way, whether we took our opportunities to have a bit more time in the ball is another thing. Um, I still think we're a long way off where we want to be. Um, I just think we um, we lacked a little bit of verb, which is disappointing. Um, you know, it's, it's the first time we've really, really had a lot of the football we've been able to get on the ball. Um, I thought we saw flashes of it, but like I say, we've got a lot of work to do to be to get to where we need to be. Yeah. But do you think there were progress made in some areas and some players progressed tonight? Were you happy I think there was. Some I, think, I think. I think. I think there was one or two. I think there was one or two that had decent games, but not enough. Yeah. Um, like I say. So really showed what they're about and, and did very very well. But like I say, there wasn't for me there wasn't enough that really stamped them. We talked about it. We talked about it in, 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 in the three games before. I still don't think we're um, aggressive enough. I've said that to them. I still don't think we've been we've been physical enough throughout the games. The first three and, and tonight, we, I don't think we were physical enough, and, and we, that's the, that, that's where we've got to improve as our starting point. On the football, we need to be better. Yeah. Um, we were a little bit hit and missed tonight on the football, but I think what we have got to do is got to realise that we have to be more aggressive. We have to be more on the front foot. Um, uh, and unfortunately, maybe there's, there's, there's a certain acceptance where, like I say, I think. I think some players need to wake up very, very quickly on that. Yes, of course. And of course, injuries, unfortunately, have been part of this pre-season uh, so far. Can't, can't be denied. Were there any new injuries tonight, Billy? And of course, Ryan Taylor was, was missing, said to be due to injury. Is, is he likely to be out? Yeah, right. I mean, obviously, Tails, we'll see what he's like for Saturday. He's, he's got a little calf problem, which, yeah. which obviously, hopefully, will only be a week. So whether he'll make Saturday or not, he's, 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 we'll see. Um, we just seem to keep picking up everything at the minute, everything that we can pick up. Ken Digg has got a slight tweak on his groin, but we'll see. Hopefully, just fatigue, he just felt it right at the end, that's why he came off. And Jordan Thewlis has, has, has um, he's got a dead leg, but he's also got a slight problem with his knee, twisted his yeah. knee a little bit. Well, hopefully, it's not it's not the major one, because like I say, with just every single game, we seem to be picking up one or two injuries. Um, obviously, we've, we've got one deals. <laughs> We've got Lundy who's obviously still recovering, like we said yeah, about his sure. and Danny Preston's way off because his ankle is in, isn't in not great. He's not broken it, thankfully, this time. But he's, but like I say, he's going to be out a certain very, you know, it's not going to be a quick fix, Pressy, which is massive. So we're looking very, very thin all of a sudden, um, you know. And we've only got two and a half weeks to go. But what we've got to do is like we've got to see more. We've got to see more from what the players, the players that signed on. We've got to see more from them, um, and and like I said, be a bit more on the front foot and aggressive. Yes, well, I will look to see that on Saturday against Solihull, Billy, and look forward to speaking to you again. No, I hope to see progress. Cheers, pal. Thank you.